Hey everyone, I wanted to show you what I've been working on. I have not finished this section yet, but I wanted to show you why it's been taking so long. Uh, so I've been working on this box right here, which I found out when I looked at the plans later. Uh, this right here will be a, a row of rivets uh, with a piano hinge. This will be where the back of the seat comes down. So now I know why this is so strong. Uh, so over here we have the Longeron going through the gusset, going through the top of the box, going through uh, the sides of the box. So it's a really, really strong area right here. And they want you to, in a few different places, drill holes for a and bolts. So I went ahead and uh, there are some parts down here where the, um, I drilled these holes as well too. And I put the bolts in and the bolts didn't fit very well. So I called my dad and said, hey, what's going on with these? And he said, um, well, what did you drill them with? I said, well, I drilled them with the a drill bit. He said, why did you drill with a drill bit? I said, how else do you drill? He said, you drill with a reamer. because These are tight fit uh, bolts. I said, what's a reamer? So he said, look in the mail tomorrow. So uh, next day, a FedEx box arrived with about 25 reamers in it on all different sizes. This is the drill bit I was using. And he said, that's, you know, pretty close to the right size, but drill bits have burrs on them, which can easily scrape the metal and not cut it in the right way but reamers are a much higher quality bit that well if you take a look you can use the sides of them to continually cut properly instead of using the tip you're using the sides to cut and that's what reams all the pieces of metal together and makes them continuously um, perfect tolerance all the way through so your bolt goes through as a tight fit now when it comes to tight fit you really want them on these gusset areas because those bolts here here, here, and here are taking so much stress from this, this uh, massive gusset and they're transferring that stress from this gusset into the Longeron and the skin and the box. And that's what it's designed for. Um, so I'll start drilling those back with uh, gussets more. And then one other thing, this box has this clip in the back which is a uh, just another strong aspect to go into the, the skin. And what I found is I wanted to start drilling it, but I realized I had to make sure all the top bolts and, um, and, and let me show you, all the, uh, the top area where the bolts will be and all these other rivets will be uh, drilled first because I want to make sure it's tightly uh, pushed hard up into this area where it will rest finally. And then that will just be an additional clip that will just add support. I was starting to drill it when it was still, um, you can kind of see it flexing between here and here. I was drilling it before um, it was ready to uh, be put in. So that's where I am right now. One of the tough parts about this particular area is um, there are a lot of pilot holes that are only a third of the way through or two thirds of the way through. So you have to keep taking this box on and off and then using one pilot hole to drill through a place that doesn't have one and then go back and then re-drill all the pilot holes together and then go up to the 30 size. I start with 40. I'm about done on both sides. And then I will go ahead and um, drill up to the 30 size and then certain areas we'll have to drill up with the reamers to where the actual um, where the actual bolt will go through. So thanks so much for watching. Sorry it's taking so long, but at the same time it's it takes a long time to figure out a super complex part like this and not like rushing it because I really enjoy the build process. So thanks for being patient.